Forecast with Chief Meteorologist Ashley Ruiz. Hey there, a very happy Wednesday to you and nice change of scenery, right? We have a lot of sunshine out there and we have a good bit of cloud cover, but still not stopping us from warming up to 91 degrees, feels like 100, and most of us are staying completely dry. So our weather pattern is flipping and it's changing for the better for a lot of us, of course, now that we're finally able to dry out just a little bit. Now we're not going to be completely dry. You can see a little bit of green popping up, but most are staying completely dry and hot. 91 in Baton Rouge, 89 in Gonzales, 95 in Opelousas, but it feels much hotter out there. 100 for a feels like temperature in Gonzales, 102 in Morgan City, and 106 for Opelousas. So if you are headed out for dinner plans, again, mostly dry conditions and temperatures will slowly fall into the lower 80s later on this evening. We'll fall into the mid 70s overnight and only a 10% chance for rain overnight and into our Thursday. It is going to be even hotter on Thursday, a high near 92 degrees and rain chance is still a little elevated, only around 40% though. So we'll have some scattered thunderstorms out there, but most are not going to see any rain. Lower rain chances into the weekend as well as high pressure starts to move in. That means our temperatures are going up. So high pressure slowly going to move in from the east on Thursday. We could still see some spotty thunderstorms out there Friday. I do think will be the driest day because high pressure is going to be overhead. That's going to limit our rain chances, but not completely zero. 20% through the weekend, about 30%. And that's going to be the case even into next week as well. And as I mentioned, temperatures are going up mid-90s over the weekend, going to feel well into the triple digits. And this is just a friendly reminder to us that, yes, it is still summertime. And we are heading into the dog days of summer. And the temperatures are reflecting that. So let's take you through the future track, showing you a few spotty showers, perhaps near the coast by the morning. And as the day goes on, we'll likely have some scattered showers and storms develop. But as you saw, rain coverage was not high by any means. Otherwise, we'll see mostly sunny to partly cloudy skies. Friday again, we'll see mostly sunny to partly cloudy skies. Mostly dry, barely seeing any green pop up. That's going to be the case on Saturday, except rain coverage will come up just a little bit, only to about 30%. I know this is showing a lot, but really not expecting much. So again, expect mostly dry conditions, not going to be completely dry, but again, only some spotty rain around with highs in the mid-90s. That's going to be the case through next week, maybe a little higher by Wednesday. Now let's get a check on your fur cast. Check out this little baby enjoying some time outside. This is Pax. Thank you to Nancy Calloway for sharing this photo. And keep in mind tomorrow we'll have some hot paws and wet paws, but overall doing better out there. Don't forget to keep your fur babies nice, cool, and hydrated. If you would like to see your pet on fur cast, just like Pax, all you have to do is send a pet photo and name of your pet to aruez at brproud.com. We'll have sports coming up after the break.